JetBlue CEO Robin Hayes is stepping down next month. He said the challenges and pressure of the job have taken a toll and on the advice of his doctor. And after talking to his wife, he plans to put more focus on his health and well-being. JetBlue's chief operating officer, Joanna Garrity, will take over as CEO. She'll become the first woman to lead a major U.S. airline. Garrity has been with JetBlue for nearly 20 years. The CEO transition comes as JetBlue tries to acquire budget carrier Spirit Airlines. That $4 billion deal was challenged by the DOJ last year. A decision by a federal judge is expected in the coming weeks. Uh, right now, JetBlue Airways stock off by about 4.8 percent. 548 was the last tick. Meantime, uh, in, I guess this is like a little bit of transition news. We're doing, we're doing stories about people moving on. Twilio co-founder Jeff Lawson announced yesterday that he's stepping down as CEO of the Enterprise Communications Software Company. He's also going to be stepping down as chairman of the board. The company has been under pressure by activists, uh, Anson Funds, and Legion partners to sell itself or divest its data and applications business. Longtime Twilio executive uh, Ko, uh, Kozima uh, Ship Chandler was named CEO, is also uh, joining the board as well. In a statement yesterday, he suggested the company would take a harder look at underperforming businesses. Anson Fund said that Jeff Lawson's departure was a step in the right direction. That stock uh, up on that news.